hi all so good evening so ravi here so today let's discuss about some new configuration that we have in dynatrace that you have heard about right uh, then dynatrace has recently uh, released a new ui around uh, six months ago but still they are supporting with old ui so both the ui is available in the mark uh, in that uh, option so you can do that but in the new ui we have a new uh, dashboard features, right? So how you can configure that new dashboards, okay? So dashboards, we need to configure based on grill logs, based on grill, okay? So you need to write a query for that. So Dynatrace query language, we have a decal query and uh, Grill is supporting for that. Okay, so Grill is just like a DVC analyzer tool. So, uh, okay, so let's see how you can configure that with the help of Query, how you can configure the dashboards in Dynatrace in the new UI, okay? So there's no any uh, theoretical explanation in that, okay? So just we need to write a Query and you need to fetch the data. So I tried a lot and just uh, let's see how we can configure that, okay? So so in the dashboard, once you open that, right? So if you search in the apps, right? If you type dashboard, there's a two dashboard we have. One in dashboard classic and new dashboard classic and new dashboard. So this is a new UI. When you open that uh, home portal, you can see that this is a new UI. You have that, okay? So let's see how you can create that, okay? Okay, so this is my dashboard. I will keep as a rename this just for infrastructure test. And then we have test hyphen observe okay so just basic okay i'm not going with any complex one first okay so just to try to understand how you can create a basic dashboard okay so i have given that sorry dashboard name infrastructure test observability okay then click on plus symbol so just you write a query grill if you type a query grill it will ask you to type a query here okay so just i wrote a query the first query it is how you can check the number of hosts. So first, where you need to do title. So title, what I should give number of hosts. Okay, and then we should go with query. So let's find the query. Control C. Control B. Run it. So now you got this, right? But you are getting with uh, some different fields, okay? So I'll go to my visualization type. Instead of uh, record list, whatever things is coming up, I'll go with single value, okay? And then done. There is no option to save here. So you should come out here, okay? So this is done. Now let me you drag drop that you aware of that, right? So this feature we have. Again, you want to create, click on plus. Add a query grill, okay. Now you want to analyze a little, okay. So first you keep it little left. Now what is the title name in the second that we have? Post availability. And then you write the query. run it data is coming up so go to visualize and take a single value so my host availability is 99 percent 100 percent okay so you want to little drag okay so done 
now you want to create okay this we have move if you want to move somewhere this is maximize duplicate edit and more action okay now let's see how you can create another one okay so query grill title name So grill title, you can give something like this. Now host uptime. Third one is my host uptime. Give this. Run this. Again, I'll take as a single value. Take like this, keep it like this, keep it like this, just for understanding, right? Now let's go to here, create next one, okay? So, Curie Grill. So, now what is the fourth one? Host state. So this is my title, host state. And I will do this, copy this, and paste it. Run the query, visualize the data, single value. The state is running. Now if you want to duplicate, Duplicate it. So now I will do that. Now what is the next one? Monitoring mode. Like we have a two types of mode, right? One is a full stack and one is infrastructure mode. So I'm keeping as a monitoring mode here. So I'm keeping as a monitoring mode and query. And this so monitoring mode not coming up. Till the state is not available. Okay, deleted. Let's create a new one. Grid log. Okay. Give monitoring mode. Control C. Make sure that there should not be any space. So now it's came, so I think there was a space. So you take as a you take as a pie chart. So we have something like this. Then you take instead of font, load, and so table you take, you see. So infrastructure one, full stack one, discovery one, monitoring underscore candidate, we have five. Okay, now go to again, you create. New Curie Grill the 
then what else we have total traffic GB by chart. No, only this is taken. Only taking a single logic. Okay. Then what else we have? Curie grill. We have something like this impacted host in last six hours. So how many hosts was impacted in last six hours? Control B, write a query. Only one host was impacted. I can take some single value pie chart is on this one also. Bar chart no table. This is not supported. This is not supported. Only pie chart will support. Okay, this you can take don't chart okay then what else we have qt grill then we have available process and cpu memory uses Okay, you can take as a graph, this is also fine. So you can put as a grid log. Something you want to move, something like this. Okay, you can move, okay. So now this is for which one? Available is done. Top 10 host based on CPU conjunction. Okay. Now this is done. Now what else we have? Now I'm taking as a recent top queries run in database. Right. So now I'm doing this is the last. So this is not taking. So let's Put it, retry, no. The end of the query is not allowed here. Please check auto complete suggestion before end of all. Okay, so errors are coming, okay. That's fine, then what I can do is, let's do this. Edit. Then you can go with open with 
some log and see when you try so log also you can try okay so switch to simple mode advanced mode no no it is not coming Okay, so this fine, that's fine, okay, leave this, okay. So now let's uh, first you, number of host, now you want to move, keep it here, host availability, so let's keep it like this. it like this this is host uptime it running Total traffic. So this is the way you can create based on the grill logs, you can create a dashboard, okay, in Dynatrace, okay. So the query, uh, I'll mention in the descriptions, yeah, when you uh, buy the recorded session for Dynatrace end-to-end, -end, the query will get available for, not for only this, okay, a lot of query will get available. You can go and find in your query accordingly, and then you can uh, create a dashboard based on your requirement, okay. So hope you understood that, okay. Uh, query I'm not explaining because uh, you need to understand that DQL query language, okay. For that you need to take a support or something, but however, uh, this will help you how you can create a dashboard. You can you can see the query, you can write the query, uh, you watch the video and then you can understand that, right? And then you can create your dashboard in Dynatrace. And Dynatrace has a, way, a good uh, Dynatrace documentation page even that support is very good. So that you can check with them. Okay, is that fine? Okay, that's it for this lecture. Okay, thank you.